Hey everybody, it's Angie and welcome to Hot and Flashy. In today's video, I wanted to do a little spring dress addendum to my spring lookbook that I put up a couple of weeks ago. I was struggling to find some awesome spring dresses that I wanted to show to you guys. I did have a few in that video, but they were mainly black. And so I had said that I was definitely going to do a part two once I found some good dresses. And I have found some great dresses, so I wanted to bring them to you and show them to you here today. So um, let's just quickly recap the two dresses that I showed you a couple weeks ago because what I forgot to mention is that these, even though I showed them in black, they both come in lots and lots of colors. These are available also in flower patterns and bright patterns, so I'll show you all the colors that each one is available in. So one is more of a uh, longer, like gauzy material, loose, floaty wrap dress with some ruffles on it. It's really, really pretty. It's great in the black, but it also comes in all these colors and all these floral patterns. And then the other dress is a much more structured dress that um, can be worn to work or to a family occasion. And that one also comes in a number of other solid colors. And in that video, I was wearing a white faux leather jacket that you guys went crazy for, and you completely sold it out in the first like hour after the video. So I have been searching high and low for a replacement white faux leather jacket, and I have found a really good one at the same price point. So really inexpensive. And it is this guy right here. I'm so happy that I found this one. It has all the same moto detailing. It's got the super soft white faux um, leather, and uh, it's just really cute. And I love how this one fits. This one I got in a small, and I would say that it fits true to size or it's a little bit snug. So if you're between sizes, I would size up on this guy, but it's a perfect transitional piece. But I did want to let you guys know that I found another one and it is just as good as the one that I showed a couple weeks ago. I always link all of my sizing information, my height, my weight, um, what size I took the item in, and whether it runs large or small so that you can figure out what size to get. So all you have to do do is open the info box below the video just click that show more button and that will open you scroll down you can see everything by outfit and the links will be right there for quick and easy shopping for you so today we're going to take a look at all of these beauties including this one that I have on I just love this dress it's such a cutie it does have a bit of a puff sleeve I'm wearing them unbuttoned but there is a sleeve button here if you want it to look a little neater there's a little ruffle here at the neck and this is just kind of a fit and and flare. It's actually a dark navy blue. It's not black and it has this really sweet flower pattern on it and I just love the pattern on this. It's got a lot of yellows and bright oranges and pinks and baby blues and stuff so it's really a pretty dress and I love how lightweight and floaty the fabric is. This is really giving me that 70s vibe. You know what it reminds me of is the mom in Firefly Lane. Who's watching that? I just binge watched that whole thing last weekend and I think my favorite character in it is um, Tully's mom, right? She is awesome. I mean not the best mom, but I just love her style and I love her whole like 70s vibe look. I also popped on this hat with it. This is a wardrobe staple for me for the spring and the summer. I take my poochies out to the yard so many times a day. I always have a hat to put on. This one is so cute inexpensive, really great looking, comes in a few different colors. So the sandal I have on is this sandal that I have left over from last year. I love this shoe. I love it that it's got snake on the straps, but it also has these little studs. They are just awesome. And I have to have a little bit of a heel. I can't wear anything that's super flat. So I love these because they do have this little one inch stacked wood heel and they are just the cutest sandal and I think they just go great with this dress. But you could also wear it with sneakers. These are my Bionic white sneakers. Now you guys know that white sneakers are huge this year. You've got to have your white sneaks to wear with everything. These have a little bit of leopard on the heel and this is in like a patent. These are awesome because they offer great arch support and they're really fun and cute as well. The distressed denim jacket is just a spring staple. You can wear it with a cute floral 
floral dress like this, you can wear it with a longer dress like this, you can wear your denim jacket with just about everything. So next up is a super casual dress, but I love to have one of these in my spring and summer wardrobe. It's just a t-shirt dress. It goes just about to the knee, and it's just a regular t-shirt fabric, but I love the color on this one. I love this dark, dark navy blue. Of course, it does come in other colors. Um, I threw in a raincoat because I live in New England. Spring here is really not that nice. It's very, very rainy most of the time. So I grabbed this little raincoat, a little yellow slicker. All my raincoats are black. They're so dreary. And I just love this little guy. I love the contrasting black zipper. Love all the little um, toggles and the netting inside. It's got a hood. It's got the little trench vent in the back, elasticized waist. I would throw it on over just about anything, but I think it looks really cute with this dress. Yay, we're up to the red dress. This was such a pleasant surprise. I ordered this because, of course, it looked fantastic on the model. When it came in, I was like, mm, not so sure about that. When I put it on, I was like, oh yes, 100% on this dress. I love this dress. It is just the perfect spring, summer, um, casual, date night, island hopping, whatever you're going to do this summer and spring, you need this dress. It just looks so good. I love this color. I love this hot cherry red for spring. It just looks so great. This deep plunging V. Of course, you do need a bra that you're not going to see. I think I'm showing it with just my bra and you can see it peeking out a little bit there. Um, but you can also, if you need like a little modesty panel in there, you can put a little bralette on under it, something with a little bit of lace. This one is super cute. I just got this one a couple weeks ago this is one of those soft bralettes with no underwire it's so comfortable just to give you like a little bit of coverage right there so you don't see your bra but um, I couldn't believe how flattering it was on I absolutely love it and I think it's because of where the waistband is placed and then it has gathers below and above so it hides everything that's going on in your midsection it just skims over everything so nicely it's a really good length but it's not um, a straight across hem. It's like a scooped hem, so you get a little bit of your leg peeking out at the side. What I love about this dress is that it shows off all the assets right here, but it disguises that, <laughs> that little bit of arm flub right here. Who is with me on this? I don't know what had happened, but at some point my skin just gave up the ghost and it just will not hold in whatever this little thing is here. So I have this little bit of arm flub that if I wear certain tops, it's really accentuated. I really wanna wear this someplace hot on the beach. It's a perfect dress for that, but you gotta get it now, otherwise it's gonna sell out and it won't be around in the summer. So anyway, that is a beautiful dress. All right, then the next three are a little bit more business-like. I grabbed these because they are from the same maker as the more structured black dress that I showed earlier in the video and I was looking at that brand just for other dresses and I thought that these two were just so pretty and could work for lots of different figure types. So this one has a higher neckline and it's more of a halter style so if you're someone who really likes your shoulders but you want to be covered up here in the front and you want to look longer and leaner and slimmer. It's got a little twist detail in the front and then it's got a wrap skirt but the inside wrap goes all the way across so you don't have to worry about the wind blowing and exposing anything. And this is a really nice like stretchy jersey. The um, structured dress from before, the black one with the ruffle, is a much heavier fabric and this one is just a more lightweight. This is more of like a spring summer dress. Um, it's got a little flow to it. I love the shape on this one. It's very slimming and it works for all body types. A lot of the Amazon reviews on this were from people who were bustier and who who were trying to not have their chest be like, you know, hello, here I am. And they loved this dress for that. They said it had enough detail on the top, but it wasn't clingy, but it, you know, the neck was high enough. So it really got high marks for that. It does give you the coverage here. It cuts at an angle so that it leaves your little arm flub covered and oh thank goodness. These dresses come in lots and lots of different patterns and colors but I kind of like the blues the best and the shoes I have on with that are these platform mules. I am so in love with these. I showed these in my lookbook and they are just 
so great. I'm going to be wearing these constantly. I love the shape of the heel. It's covered with a brown python faux leather that has some texture to it. And I just like that it's a simple slide-in mule, but it looks so great with everything. I just love it with those dresses. I mean, I suppose for the office, you might want to wear a pump with these. I just, you know, I don't work in an office, and so I don't tend to buy pumps. They are, they kind of torture my feet. Obviously, you can change up the look by changing up the shoe, but I like these with them and I love this shoe. And then the next one after it that's also blue and black, this one's a little bit more of a vibrant blue and black, but this is from the same maker. And this is more of your standard wrap dress. So it's got your v-neck with the wrap and then it just ties over here on the side. And then uh, this one has a little bit more of a tulip shaped skirt. And again, this one has the little cap sleeve so it cuts in here so it hides that little is there a name for it? Someone tell me in the comments below if there's a name for this, right? I know there is. There's a name for everything. Not that I'm obsessing about mine, but um, just something I've noticed lately is that I like a top that covers it up or a dress that covers it up, and these do. So this is kind of the same fabric as this guy. I'd say this one is the thinnest fabric. This one is a little bit more substantial, has a little bit more to it, and then the black one from earlier is the thickest, not that it's really thick, but it's more of like a scuba kind of fabric, and so um, it will definitely skim over the body and hide any bumps and, you know, ripples, whereas this one might be, you know, you might need to wear a Spanx or something under this one. So this next dress I tried on, and it was instant love at first sight. I was just like, oh, it's like it was made for me. I love this dress. This one is a little bit more ladylike, a little bit more dressy, so this is the kind of thing that you could wear to an afternoon wedding or a brunch or a shower, or you could even wear it to work with a blazer. The fabric on this is really beautiful. It's got this little sweet leopard print. It's like a dark gray with a little bit of peach in it. It's got a high neck and just a little cap sleeve. Again, hides those things. Um, and then it's just got a fit and flare skirt. And I love how the skirt flares out a little bit at the bottom, but it does have a little slit there at the knee. This is a great looking dress. I put it with this other moto jacket that I have just because the colors in these were so perfect together. The um, salmon peachy color in the dress and the peachy kind of tan color of the moto jacket really went together. Unfortunately, I ordered this a size too big. This is a small. It's a little bit too big for me. The arms are definitely a little bit too large, so I'm going to have to return this one for an extra small, but this is a super cute moto as well. Also faux. I love the color on this one for spring. I think it's really pretty, and I think it would make a great outfit, obviously, with this dress, but with a lot of other dresses or you can wear it with jeans and a t-shirt. I mean, this is just gonna be like a great staple spring piece. And yes, I do think they are torture chambers, but I do have a standard pump, and I thought this went so well with this outfit. These come in a wide width, and so they're a little bit wider in here. These are just a beautiful nude patent leather with a pointy toe, a nice heel. You know, I'm not terribly comfortable in them. I couldn't wear them to walk anywhere, but they sure did go nicely with that outfit. Outfit, so I'm showing them with that. All right, and then the last dress, this is a maxi dress, and this one is really hitting all the bells and whistles of the trends this year. It is maxi, and it's got all the tears and all the little um, ruffles, and it's got the balloon sleeve. It's got sheer fabric. This is really sweet because it's got this nice lavender slip dress underneath that's included with it and it really goes so well with the fabric of the dress so it has a little snap here i should probably snap that but the fabric on this is so pretty as well it's a really lightweight sheer gauze and it's got like a lavender and kind of a yellow tiger stripe pattern to it but the way that this dress is constructed it's just so beautifully made it does have a little i don't have it tied it does have a little tie belt right here um, but I love this yoke in the back with the gathers. It's just so gorgeous. But what I love about this dress is that even though it is hitting the trends, it's doing it in such a light and airy kind of way where a lot of the dresses that I tried on that had all the ruffles and all the tears, they were just overwhelming. And 
I just didn't like them and I love this one because it's just so ethereal. Again, another one that I would take island hopping. <laughs> Definitely starting to think about packing up for a trip and you know buying clothes to wear to a wedding or to some kind of a family get together, celebration or whatever. And this is just a beautiful dress for that. So I love that one too. The platform sandals that I have on with this outfit are these guys. These I've owned for a couple of years. I'm so happy to see that they are still in stock in stores. They haven't gone out of style because these are my go-to summer and spring sandals. I wear these like almost every day and I love the huge platform on these but I love it that you know you got a heel in the back but they have such a big platform in the front that you're it's really not like wearing a heel. They're so comfortable and the upper here is so soft that it never pinches my toes. It's really easy to get in and out of and these are in like a taupe suede and they go with everything. So that is everything that I had to show you here today. If you're interested in shopping with me, hit up the links in the information box below the video. As I said before, all my sizing and all the information on everything will be down there. If you enjoyed the video, go ahead and give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. As always, I thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate your time. Have a great day and I will see you in the next video. Take care everybody. Bye-bye.